Hey guys, in this video I will show you how you can do a reverse clip in DaVinci Resolve for the iPad to create something amazing like this. So in this video I will actually show you two ways, one in the cut page and one in the edit page. If you don't know how to open the edit page, I made a video here on my channel where I show you how you can unlock all of the pages for DaVinci Resolve on the iPad. So first method here in the cut page. So I drag my clip into my timeline. Now it's the regular size. I played everything in normal. And what you want to do is either right click, longer press on the clip, then you see here speed. Then this one will open up. Or you can open, if it doesn't isn't open yet, you can click the clip, come here to the settings, and then this icon is the speed. And so to reverse everything, you have to now put those numbers in negative. So minus one is everything in normal speed in reverse. So minus one. And now if we look through the clip, everything is now backwards. And I created this kind of effect. So let's undo this one. If you come to the edit page and you have your normal clip here in your timeline, you can also come in here in the edit page and do right click and then come here to change clip speed. You will get this new window here where you can change the speed in percentage and a lot of other things like freeze frame for example, but you can also do here reverse speed and now everything is reversed as well. And this is how you do reverse clips in DaVinci Resolve for the iPad. I hope you liked this video and you learned something. If you want to learn more about DaVinci Resolve on the iPad, I made a complete masterclass from beginner to pro. If you want to check this one out, there's a link in the description. I'm Daniel. See you in the next video. Bye.